Hello, Wastelanders. It's your local responder, Kelso Roof. Today, I am going to show you how to make forest disease cures and antibiotics. Now, let's get in here. First thing you're going to do is go to healing and go to disease cures. You're going to need two blood leaf, one boiled water, two fire caps, and two snap tail reeds. We're going to make those first. When I make disease cures or anything that takes flora, I use this perk card right here in perception. Just takes one. Green thumb. Reap twice as much when harvesting flora. So instead of getting one, you get two. So the first place that I go to is Silkum Joe's, and then I come all the way around here. All around here, you'll be able to get a bunch of fire caps. You can also get starlight berries. I'm just going to show you Silkum Joe's right now. The very first place you're going to want to go to is over here by the bus. You can get one to three of them on this log right here. Using green thumb is great because you need two fire caps for one disease cure. Come over here. Normally you get another one over here. It's not over here this time. It's right here. And you'll get another one. Normally. Right here. Let's see if there's one up here to grab. Doesn't look like it. I'd like to grab one more. There we go. Next, we'll go get some blood leaf and some snaptail reeds, which you can get this at Hill Folk Hot Dogs. You'll come up and around here. And you can come all the way down here as well, go along this shoreline to get more. I immediately just take a left and come down here. And then I go straight from here. Got blood leaf there. Should I grab two? Let's see if we run down here. Oop disappeared. There's one there. And let's see if we can find another one down here. Right there. There we go. Let's take care of this. 
something else. Okay, while we're here, we'll collect four dirty water. Because you need two dirty water to make one boiled. Alright, now let's go back to camp. Now what I use to get the most out of my stuff when I'm making Kim's and Abe are these two perk cards. Chemist, which you just need one in intelligence. You get double the quantity when you craft Kim's. And then Super Duper, which has 10%, 20%, and 30% depending on your rank. When you craft anything, there is a 30% chance you'll get double the results. So if you've got Chemist on with Super Duper, instead of getting two, you could get three. So let's make some disease cures. They'll be under healing. I forgot to make boiled water. So we'll do that first. Now we'll make some disease cures. Now the next thing I'm going to make is antibiotics. Let's see what we need for this. You need three antiseptic, one blood pack, two disease cures, two purified water, and three stem packs. Antiseptic I believe is out of like a Braxo cleaner. You can get a lot of it from there. Blood packs, how you make blood packs is tick blood. Which when I'm farming to try to get blood packs, the easiest place that I've gone to find ticks and I will server hop to do so is the Moonshiner Shack. You can find four. Doesn't always drop tick blood, but you need two of them to make one blood pack. Let's see, stem packs, antiseptic, blood pack, and steel. Let's make some more. That way I have enough for antibiotics. You'll also need pharmacist to rank three, and you need chemist for these antibiotics. Pharmacist rank one does right away removes thirty percent of radiation. Rank two is sixty percent, and then rank three. Right away removes twice as much radiation, so it's really good. But you'll need it to make those. 
So right now, with making that and having the chemist perk card and the super duper, I made nine antibiotics just by getting enough disease cures, enough stuff for disease cures for two of them. So it's, it's really worth it to invest in the green thumb perk, chemist, and super duper. You'll need chemist and pharmacist to make antibiotics, which the difference between the two is disease cures, no matter where the region's from, it'll, it'll cure all any of the diseases. That's all it does, just cures one disease. Where antibiotics gives you disease resistance. So it's good to have. I sell my antibiotics for 20 caps a piece and they go by real fast. But that was all that I wanted to show you guys today. I hope it was helpful. I'll see you guys later. Bye.